Welcome. In this segment, we're going to be talking about how to search for e-journals in the SUNY ESF e-journals database. Let's say you've tried searching for a journal title in the Moon Library catalog, and you're not having much luck finding it in print or an electronic link. The next step that you want to take is to go to the actual e-journals database, and there's a number of ways that you can search this database. To access the e-journal database, you want to go to the Moon Library homepage, which again is www.esf.edu slash moonlib. To search the e-journals database, it's actually the default search. E-journals, and then it has a default search of find titles that begin with. We're going to talk about the other ways that you can find journal titles. There's more than just that default search. It's important that when you get into that search uh, box is to click the pull down menu. There's four ways that you can actually search our eJournals database, and we're going to walk through those four ways. Title begins with, title equals, title contains all words, and ISSN equals. So let's walk through each search because most people just go in and search the default search, but I want to talk about all four searches. For title begins with, you would type in as much as you know about your title, the beginning part of it, of course. So here we're doing Journal of Forestry. I enter in Journal Forestry, I click Search, and it alphabetically retrieves for me all titles that begin with Journal of Forestry. So I would take a close look at this list to determine which record is the one I want to use, and then I would carefully look to see what coverage there is, what databases have this title, and what kind of year and volume coverage they have. And I would have to pick the one that works for me. Many of our journals in the eJournal database have coverage from more than one database. So maybe there's a database that you prefer over another one. Or maybe there's a database that has the coverage that you need. So it's very important before you go into that journal to take a look and see what that coverage is and the name of the database. Let's go on to talk more about Title Begins With. So sometimes the Title Begins With search will give you more than what you're looking for, which sometimes can be a bonus because it will truncate your search after your initial search and give you more. So Journal of Forestry, if we look back, it actually gave you other Journal of Forestries. So it could broaden your search a bit. Again, you want to be careful to read through the coverage that's offered for each database. And it's important to note that other than just the licensed databases that we have, we do have links to open access databases. So sometimes when you're looking at a link for an e-journal, it's not something we subscribe to, it's a free open access database. So you're going to see a multitude of databases and open access databases in our eJournal lists. Moving on, let's talk about the next search. The next search is title equals. And that's a very exact search. If I type in Journal of Forestry under title equals, again using that pull down menu, I will get an exact match. Again, you're going to notice that it's in more than one database you need to carefully choose the right database. If you're not finding your title in the e-journals, you tried an exact title search, you're not having much luck, you could go back and check the library catalog again, see if we have the print version or the e-journal link is there. If you still can't find your e-journal, you might try searching the internet for the article that you want in quotes. Sometimes you can find the article and another database or even on the author's page. Sometimes it's worth taking the extra step and doing an internet search again for your article in quotes. That's again after you've searched the eJournal page and the SUNY ESF library catalog. There's one more option. If you've tried searching the eJournal page and the library catalog and the internet and you're not having much luck for your article, you can use our interlibrary loan services. You would visit our interlibrary loan website and you would tell us the article that you're looking for. Most often, libraries will scan the article and email them directly to you. Another search that you could use, again, using the pull-down menu for e-journals, title contains all words. This is a really great search because I can put any kind of keyword in that search box, and it will bring back to me all of those e-journals that we have access to in an alphabetical list. I searched for forestry in this example and it brought back almost 60 results. So, in a title contains all words, it's a great way to search your topic to see what e-journals are out there. Maybe you don't know what journals are on your topic. Maybe you're just getting to start on your research and you need to learn about what professional readings are out there on your topic. 
going into this search, the titles contains all word search, and putting in your keyword is a great way to get started. This is also a great way to find out what databases are appropriate for your topic. If you type in a keyword and it brings back your results, we'll go back again. Sometimes you'll see the same database over and over, and then you'll be like, oh, that's the database for my topic. And then you could try going right into that database. So I really like Title Contains All Words. You can put in any keyword, and it will suggest back to you not only the journals that we subscribe to, but also open access journals that we have links to. So again, Title Contains All Words, a great way to get started on your research. The last search available is ISSN. And usually that's used when you have the exact um, identification number for your serial. It's, it's officially called the International Standard Serial Number. Um, sometimes you see that number listed in references, and that's a good way to get an exact match. But usually you're using the other three searches. So again, to summarize, to search the SUNY ESF eJournal database, go to the Moon Library homepage. Our default search is for the eJournal database, but remember, there's more than just that default search of Title Begins With. I highly recommend trying the other search options, especially Titles Contains All Words. And remember, if you can't find your eJournal in the eJournal database, go back and try our library catalog. Maybe we have it in print, and maybe we have the eJournal link in our catalog. If you still can't find your eJournal in the library catalog or the eJournal database, try searching the internet for your article in quotes. If you've exhausted all of those searches, the next step would be to try an interlibrary loan where the library does the work for you and gets the article sent to you either as an e-version or we get a photocopy for you. So there's lots of ways that we can get your journal articles for you. I hope you've learned something about searching for e-journals today and I hope that you take these opportunities to search for your e-journals. That's all for now and thanks for joining me. I'll see you next time.